Me is here. You is welcome. Bob is you. Let's continue on from last time in the lake. We're in like the second... How do I like... I go back here? Yeah. The second little... Well, the first little mini world, I guess, or sub world. Whatever this means. And yeah, we have seven out of eight, I suppose, of those dandelion things. And then here we have three out of eight, but total we have 11. So I don't know what any of, any of that means, but let's jump into Pillar Yard. Bob is you, wall is stop, pillars push. Also, I did forget to mention last time that obviously, please no spoilers or explanations of things. I don't wanna know anything about this game. Just getting that out of the way. Uh, pillar is push, wall is stop, Bob is you, star is defeat, flag is win. Okay. So what do we do with this? We can push a whole bunch of... Do I line up all the pillars and like push the flag out? I think I can maybe do that. Oh! No, because flag is not push. Okay. Never mind. But wait! If we do this, and then we change pillar, we get this down, and then make pillar is you. Now I can go into the flag. There you go. Pillar yard. And then brick wall. Oh, that's very... Okay, wait, hold on. So this is probably the scaling thing that I mentioned last time. So if we go in and do, like, default... Nothing changes. Uh, oops, didn't mean to do that. Great, I clicked outside the window perfectly on my stop recording button on the audio. It's a good thing I noticed that. So, uh, what was I doing? I wanted to check zoom mode, like none. I think it's like none is, oh, there we go. Yeah, I see. But then, yeah, what what's... What's default? Default compared to stretch seem the same. I guess in like smaller levels, it'll stretch it out to the screen, but maybe in big levels, stretch will like shrink those big ones to have it all in one screen, but with default, you'll like see a, a part of it or something. I guess, I guess let's leave it on stretch for now. And then we'll see when we get to, like, a really big level or something. Bob is you, flag is win, and wall is stop. But yeah, I can't just, like, do Bob is win. No, that doesn't work. Uh... Baba is you, and then Baba is win. There you go, yeah. You can have multiple is connected to one one, like, word. Submerged ruins. Oh, man, there's, like, sub-levels within sub-levels? Okay. Well, let's keep going here. Lock. Key is open. Key is push. Flag is win. Bob is you. Wall is stop. Door is stop. Door is shut. Okay, so... Key is open means it'll interact with whatever says that it's shut. So if we had, like, rock is shut, then key would open rock. All right. So that opens it. Yeah, I see. And then we open this and we get rock out and then we can do rock is open. Uh, oh shit, hold on. Let's just push this over here. Oops, didn't mean to do that. I guess I could just undo it. Seems like uh, we're going to be doing a lot of... Oh yeah, Rock is Push as well. We're going to be doing a lot of undoing in this game. Yeah, there we go. Now Rock is Push and Rock is Open. Okay. Seven and then ten. So we have seven, then eight, then who knows what's up there. Man, what is happening with the level layout? 
Novice Locksmith. Key, open, key, shut. So we can do key is push or key is open, but not both at the same time. Bob is you, door is stop, wall is stop, flag is win. So we just do key is push, push it onto the door or next to the door, and then... No, I guess we just, we put this, like... Hold on, just push this over here. And we just want both of the concepts, like, at the same time. So just here. And there we go. Key is open, key is push. Door is shut, and we can just remove that. Door is not shut. Flag is win. Oh. Wait, do door is open. Door is open. No, that doesn't work. Door is push. Door is push. That's 13. Okay, locked in. Shelly is stop. Wall is stop. Flag is win, Bob is you. Wall is defeat. What does that mean? Wall is stop? I see, because if I remove wall is stop, that means we get defeated when touching the wall. Okay. What happens if we do wall is jelly? Oh, I see. Yeah, okay, there we go. And, uh... Yeah, what do we do here? That, that just, like, changed them permanently. All of the walls are now jellies, and that doesn't change if you break the rule. Okay. But we don't have any... any flag, so how do I... What happens if I, like, if I push a sprite over here? To say, like, this... Oh, I can't. Uh... I guess just this. Jelly is win. Yeah, that's too bad. I wanted to see if I could, like, push a starfish or star and say star is win, even though it's not, like, the word. Would that still count? Area clear! No, it's not. What? I mean, eight out of eight, I suppose. Okay, and we get a flower. I'm really confused by the level layout in this game. It's... It's all over the place. So now we have number two, Solitary Island. But let's keep going here. And do... So if we go in here, Submerge Ruins. Level Lake Extra 1, Submerge Ruins. Okay, well, let's not do this yet. Let's do Changeless. Rock is rock, flag is rock. Bob is you. Wall is stop. Oh, what? Why does that happen, like, when I move? If I wait as well? It's like, this is the... The setup, the initial setup, and then... Flag is going to turn into rock as soon as I move. In any way. But I can't prevent that. But I can do... Rock is flag instead, just change the order. What? Why is that wrong? Oh, because rock is rock. We need to like break this to begin with. And now it works. That rock is flag. Okay. So it like hold on, I wanna I wanna go in there again and see like how do they handle those conflicts? Is it always the one that was like in effect to begin with? So if you, like, remove this, and then do rock is flag, it works. Now if we do rock is rock... This is weird, like, it didn't... Huh? Okay. Because rock is rock, it cancels out the rock is flag... The, yeah, rock is flag rule... But because I've already changed rock into flag, it doesn't change it back because rock is rock. I don't know. It's kind of confusing. 
I'm sure we'll uh, learn to understand that completely later on. Two doors. Key is push and open. Kiki is you. Door is shut. Hedge and door is stop. Flag is win. Well, we can just do door is you. I guess that doesn't help. Because we don't have anything... Where's the wind condition? Oh, down there, yeah. So we need to... We need to do something about the hedge. How do I do that? And door is shut. If I just remove this, it doesn't, like, change anything about the door. So shut doesn't mean you, like, if you remove the rule for shut, it doesn't mean you can walk through it. Just that shut is just a modifier that it can be opened by something that says open. I guess we do door is you. And then I walk over here, and then switch this back. Uh... Because if I just... Oh, I can't do it now. If I just walk into the key, isn't that gonna kill me? No. What? Oh, because door isn't shut now. But if I do that... Uh, I guess I can't push this. I can. Yeah, that just kills me. Like that. I thought so. And I can't do, like, Kiki is shut in any way. I can't do push for anything. I can't push any of these. What can I even do? Key key is you, door is stop, hedge is stop, door is shut, key is open, key is push. Yeah, I'm not sure that just list of rules actually really helps that much because you need to see where they are in relation to all the other words for it to be useful. Yeah, I feel like we're gonna get to a point where cutting is gonna be very prevalent in the series. If it's just me staring at a screen. That's kind of why I don't like block pushing games, because... You know, compared to, uh... Other puzzle games, other puzzle games, like 3D puzzle games and whatever, are generally point and clicks and stuff. You generally always have something to try, you just go around testing things, walking around, clicking objects on different things and whatever. Even if you don't know what to do, you still... You still play the game, whereas block pushing is just like, there is no point pushing anything unless you know what it is you have to push. So you just kind of like, sit here, and I have to do a lot of cutting when that gets really severe. What if we do... If we push this stuff over here, key is shut, because then key is shut and key is open, so will it kill itself? It does. Okay. That's it. But then... Then we still have to do door is you. There we go. Okay. Yeah? Man. This is not... Not going to go well, I feel. When we get into the, like, deeper levels. Jelly Throne. Flag is flag. Flag is push. Bob is you. Jelly is win. Flag is stop. Flag is push and flag is stop. What does that mean? I guess that just means 
if we remove fla flag as push, we still can't go through it. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I think this is going to ruin it, but if we do jelly is baba, doesn't that convert the jelly into baba or does it is it the opposite? Yeah. But maybe that's good. Cuz then we can remove flag is stop. And then just push and do flag is win instead. There we go. Yep. Okay, that works. I feel like there's probably a lot of like different solutions for a lot of these. Especially once we get into the deeper levels, I imagine there's going to be tons of different ways you can do stuff. Crab storage. Win, defeat, Baba is... I see, so you have to like push something past all of that and have it not... not break. Baba is you, door is shut and stop. Flag is push, hedge is stop. Baba is open. Yeah, so if I open the door, I'm dead. We can push the flag as well. And do flag. Flag is open. Like that. And then open it with that. Does work, and then we get crab. Okay, so what happens here? Baba is crab. Okay, that doesn't work. Uh... I can't push this. Crab is push. Baba is crab. Doesn't do anything. Crab is defeat. Crab is win. But I guess that doesn't work. No. Okay, so you can't do that. That's what I was wondering last time. Or was it last time? That, like, the sprite can't define the rule. So just because we put the crab here, it doesn't change anything. Okay, let's redo all of this. I feel like the first step seems decent. To do flag is open and then open the door. Because, yeah, there's no way to get out of this self-contained area because hedge is stop and it's on the outside of the hedge that stops it. And with a sprite here, we can't do anything else. If we do, like, open, open is win. No, that doesn't work. I guess it's just, it's just that, like, okay, I didn't pick up on this, that the ones, the words that have blocks, those are, like, the end words. The words that have just words, like, like this one. Those have to be the start ones. So you can't do, like... But you you can do Baba is Flag. Yeah. You can do that. But you can't do two of these block words for some, some reason. You can't do Open is Win. If we do Baba is flag, and then Baba is open, now we can, like, sacrifice- oh shit. We can sacrifice one Baba, yeah, and still be alive. But does that matter? That's just functionally the same as having done flag is open and then pushed the flag into the- into the door. 
Baba is crab. Yeah. Uh, can we do crab is Baba? But I don't think it would do anything. Baba is Baba. Baba is defeat. Yeah, it kills all of the Babas. So that doesn't work. And there's no way we can push this flag into, like, flag is win. What happens if you do Baba is push? Oh, right, Baba's open. Hold on. Remove this. And then I still can't push. Yeah, like, why isn't this lit up? That Baba is push. It is lit up, but this one is not. That's just how it looks? Yeah, it's a little confusing that, like, this is showing that it's an active rule, but the push doesn't change. But here, the open does change. Why does that happen? Yeah, that's confusing. Why this one doesn't, like, go brighter, the push, when it's, like, in a legitimate rule. Yeah, I, I really don't know. I don't know what we could do here. Oh, man. Yeah, I'm, like, extremely worried about this game. Like, everyone always say it, says how incredible this game is, and it does look good, but I am scared of this game. Like, I'm not sure this is a good Let's Play game, if it just will devolve into just looking at the screen for 20 minutes at a time and not making any progress, because I just can't think of what it is you have to do. If it's, like, the, that one specific thing that works and everything else does not work. I don't know. We will see. I don't understand how we could push anything past defeat, which would kill it, and then into win, and then still have one left to actually, like, fix it. I guess it would be Baba, because we have two Babas. So Baba can be win, and then Baba is... Like, crab or something. Yeah, I, I guess that's... Hold on. So... We have to do this part again. Flag is open. And then... We need, like, Baba is... No, no, no. No, yeah, that, that doesn't work. I want to, like, be the crab, but I can't be the crab because Baba is you. Crab isn't you. I would want to, like, be the crab, push the Baba up to here, which would kill any existing Baba, but that doesn't matter because there is no Baba, and then I push, like, crab into Baba is crab. But I guess that would be the opposite anyway. It should be Crab is Baba if you want to, like, convert Crab into Baba. Is it the whole, like, rule thing? If we have Baba is Baba set up, Well, I don't think that would matter. Baba is Baba and Baba is Crab? That can't happen. Ah! Crab is defeat, Crab- okay, there we go. Jesus. Yeah, that is- that is kind of insane. 
good lord. Burglary. It's honestly kind of kind of surprising to me that a game like this was so like mainstream popular in that sense. Like everyone talks about Baba is You. It's not just puzzle fans. It's like everyone. I've seen plenty of streamers that never play puzzle games play this game. It just like became a phenomenon, and it's kind of strange to me because it's like such a a niche type of thinking required for this. Like it really appeals to the the fans of Sokoban stuff. But I mean, we're probably not even scratching the surface yet. Key is defeat. Uh huh. But key is open. And star is push. Well, we could just ignore the key and just do star is open. What? Oh, because door... Doors only stop, it's not shut. Well, damn. What do we do about that, then? We can do, like, key is shut, but that's not gonna... Not gonna help. I see. I guess we, like, we do wall is shut. Oh, hold on. We need to do wall is shut so that I can then unlock it with, like, the star. Wall is shut. Star is open and push. Oh, whoops. Uh, the wall. There we go. And then, do we just do, like, key is win, even though key is defeat? What, what happens with that? Oh, we can just, like, move this. Just remove that. Key is no longer defeat. Now key is win. Okay, that one was pretty straightforward. And that's it. No animation or anything like that. It's just, all right, move on. Submerge ruins. Baba is you, ball is stop. Crab, flag is defeat win. So we push that through. And then crab becomes defeat, but flag flag becomes win. And then... We can get, like, rock out of here, but... Bob is rock doesn't work, but rock is you. We can, like, move out, but... That's still not gonna work. If we do, like, a Baba... Oh. Oh, we can't do that. Like, Baba is wall. What happens with that? Baba's wall. Okay. I don't see what else I could do to start. To start, we have to, like... Now, flag is defeat. But we can't make, like, flag is push or something. We can do this at this point and change something. But I don't know why that would matter. I can't, like, get any of this out from here anyway. If we move this away, then we pass through the rock. And we can do that, but, yeah, that, that doesn't matter, does it? And there's no way we can get another word in past crab or flag. 
Barber is push. Yeah, that still doesn't work. We still can't push the wall. That does nothing. I do not understand. I think I just have to leave it off. Oh, man. Yeah, like, preliminarily, I really just... I'm not sure this is my type of game. I don't know. I love the aesthetic and stuff, and the concept is really fun, but... This just really isn't my type of thinking game. I just, I don't know. I know it changes a lot, so we'll keep going with it. It's not like I'm gonna stop, but it is just uh, a little insane already, and I hear it just gets worse and worse. Like, by the end game, I've heard that it's pretty fucking insane. I don't know. I'm uh, hesitant to start. We'll see if I get into it. I'm even considering if maybe this is more of a, like, stream game, so you could have some, like, live hints and help or whatever when you actually get stuck. Because, no, I do not want hints and help in the comments. Please don't. It doesn't, it doesn't work when I record, like, ahead of time. You'll be writing a comment that is, like, a week after a thing already happened. Don't bother. But yeah, we'll see if things, like, click a little more later on. But right now... Not so sure, and we can always just leave levels that I can't figure out. I should probably do that more, just like, go to different levels, figure those out. Maybe there's some like, kind of fundamental way of thinking that I need to unlock. But, thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed. We'll see uh, how things go next time.